In this segment, we will provide a brief overview of the transport panel. The transport panel is accessible in Cubase by selecting Transport, Transport Panel, or by pressing F2 on your keyboard. Now let's start by customizing the transport panel. Right-clicking, this gives you a pop-up menu where you can choose which sections you want to hide or show. Pick a preset, or create your own custom preset. You can move sections up and down, and you can show and hide sections. These two buttons let you store and delete your own custom presets. Click OK. Type in the name of your preset. Click OK. And OK again. Now we can choose our presets from the pop-up menu where they are now visible. The left meter in the performance section shows the CPU load. The right meter shows the hard drive load. If they reach the top, you will see a red flash. If so, it's time to reduce your load. One way to do that would be to disable unused tracks. The mute function doesn't prevent them from being written by Cubase. Audio plugins can use a lot of CPU power too. By applying the freeze function to the track, you will reduce your CPU usage. I'm going to explain the freeze function later on. The same parameters can be monitored by performance meters in the project window toolbar. Right click, select performance meter, then the VST performance panel under devices, VST performance. 